Hello, welcome to GM Medical Concepts. You can like our Facebook page for latest updates, it is facebook.com slash GM Medical Concepts. Let's talk about the topic syncope. By definition, syncope is transient loss of consciousness and posture, with spontaneous recovery. Syncope may be called as fainting or passing doubt. It is usually due to insufficient blood flow to the brain. It most often occurs when the blood pressure is too low. The transient loss of consciousness has other differential diagnosis as well, which might be any metabolic disorder, for example, hypoxemia, intoxication, hypoglycemia. It can be vertebrobacillar, transient ischemic attack or epilepsy. As far as differential diagnosis of syncope is concerned, it has a broad differential diagnosis. It may be neurally mediated syncope which includes pesophical syncope, carotid sinus syndrome, and situational syncope. It may be orthostatic syncope. Orthostatic syncope is usually due to fall in blood pressure after sudden change of posture. It may be psychogenic syncope. Causes of psychogenic syncope are generalized anxiety disorder, panic disorder, major depression, substance abuse, and conversion disorder. It may be drugs-induced syncope. Causes of drug-induced syncope can be divided into pesodilators, for example, nitrates, ACE inhibitors, and calcium channel blockers. Psychoactive drugs, for example phenothiazine, tricyclic antidepressants, narcotics, diuretics. Others, such as digitalis, quinidine, insulin, cocaine, or hypoglycemic. Or it may be cardiac syncope. Causes of cardiac syncope may be further divided into two subtypes. Number one, structural heart diseases, which includes aortic stenosis, hypertrophic obstructive cardiac myopathy, ahythmogenic right ventricular cardiomyopathy, acute myocardial infarction, myxoma, aortic dissection, and pulmonary embolism. Number two, arrhythmia, which includes Tachybrady syndrome, supraventricular tachycardia, ventricular tachycardia, and atrioventricular block. Now let's come to the management of syncope. Management of diseases includes careful history taking, proper investigations and respective treatment. History and examination would give us clue about the probable cause of the syncope. Few history and examination points that would help us reaching diagnosis are as follows. In vesovical syncope, there will be history of such episodes after unexpected pain, fear, or sight. In orthostatic syncope, there will be history of passing out after standing. In drug-induced syncope, there will be a clear history of taking a medicine that prolongs QT interval or cause bradycardia. In seizure, patient will be confused after the episode and there will be associated history of urinary incontinence and tongue bite. In transient ischemic attack, patient would experience diplopia, dysarthria or a focal deficit during that episode. After the proper history taking we will be able to direct our investigations in the proper direction. After getting investigations done we would treat the root cause of syncope. Now let's briefly talk about treating the syncope. While treating syncope, we assess the patient initially and look for reversible and potentially life-threatening causes like hypoglycemia and heart blocks. Initial assessment of syncope will start with BLS primary survey protocols, that is, assessment of their way, breathing, circulation, and neurologic status. After going through BLS primary survey protocols, always get ECG and blood sugar levels of every patient presenting with syncope. Syncope can be a result of many different disorders. 
to treat and manage it, we need to address the basic or root cause. In vesovical syncope, few management steps are as follows. Reassure and avoid triggers. Legs elevation. Correction of volume expansion. In hypoglycemia, a rapid intravenous infusion of 50% extrose water is given. In cardiac syncope, treat the primary structural heart disorder or arrhythmias and myocardial infarction. In psychogenic syncope, counsel the patient and consider anxiolytics and antidepressants as pharmacological management. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to subscribe our channel and like us on Facebook.